welcome back to my channel, Single Mom Review. If you would, stop for one moment, look down below and click that subscribe word. I would love for you to join my channel. You're especially going to want to make sure that you are subscribed to my channel because I am a part of a 13 channel collab. It is the Excellent Spring Dollar Tree Train collab. And Miss Jackie Russell is once again our conductor who is heading up this train. Huge thank you to Miss Jackie. She does such a wonderful job being our leader for this collab. She keeps us all in line, makes sure everything goes uh, accordingly. Also, huge thank you to Miss Tracy for Miss from Tracy and Tracy Chloe Unboxing Beauty and More. She is once again the one that does all of our multimedia. She does our ads, she does our thumbnails. Those two ladies um, do a wonderful job getting this collab up and going. So huge thank you to them. So as I said, there are 13 of us, so please do make sure that you are subscribed to all 13 of us so that you're eligible for the giveaways. I'll talk more about the giveaway at the end. Um, there will be a secret word that you're gonna need to enter my giveaway. So be watching and listening for that at the end of this video. As I said, this is the excellent spring and that is excellent with E-G-G. -G, excellent spring Dollar Tree collab. And so uh, we uh, could get Easter items, we could get spring items and do a haul from the Dollar Tree. And we were to get 10 items. I always make sure that I get my items from the $1.25 um, because I want to I, I like to share um, frugal frugal fun shopping. Um, I, I know that some Dollar Trees carry some higher a little higher priced items but um, I still like to do that Dollar 25 route. I just think it's funner trying to uh, keep on that budget so that's what I try to do. Let's get into this so I don't waste any more of your time. Let's see what I got. All right, the, all right, the first thing here is everybody is into gnomes, and so I thought this was just adorable. This is a little pink and white gingham uh, gnome. He's got his little cap has some glitter, some little glitter sparklies here for his little cap. So he's a little Easter gnome. We've got some little bunny ears here. Super cute. They did have all kinds of colors. I think they had purple, blue, green, but I thought the big pink was cute. So I got the pink one. I think I might put him in my classroom, maybe. All right, the next thing I got, you guys know I love signs. He's so cute. Look at that, welcome Easter. I don't know if I'm gonna put this um, outside my do classroom door. I think it's so cute. I think that may be where it goes. I just thought it was adorable. I love the little Easter bunny with his eggs in the back of the truck. The little cotton tail, kind of a 3D there. That is actually a cotton ball that's outside of the of the decor here. So super cute. The, the feet come up off of the face here. So it is really 3D. So I think it's just adorable. I like the little act. The little added, you know, the wood coming up here and the little, um, the little cotton ball. Super cute. So I really like this. That was my, probably the cutest sign, I thought. All right, and then the next thing here is another sign. This was cute. I love these little beads here. All right, but it hangs like this, and it says, Welcome to... Cottontail Farms, and it has the pink truck. So I thought those two signs would go very well together. Um, you know, maybe put one inside of my classroom and one outside my classroom. The fenders on the truck here make it 3D. The fenders come up off of the flat wood. I like the way they kind of tried to do a little something different with their signs and doing some 3D imaging on there. I like that. I love the added beads right here. Just think that gives it a little bit more style. So I thought this was cute. All right, then a shelf setter. You guys know I love my shelf setters for my classroom. This says Easter. It's got the three cotton tails here. I actually think I might have gotten one of these after I've got this home. I thought I might have got one of these last year. I think I ended up giving it away as a gift, um, like in a in a box. Uh, friend mail or giveaway or something but um, 
I thought this was cute. I liked how it had the cotton balls again. And it says Easter. And this is a perfect shelf setter for my classroom. All right, the next item is a pillowcase. I thought these were, this was super cute. It's the pink and white gingham. You kind of see a theme here, right? Both of my signs had were the pink tracks. Um, the gnome was a pink and white gingham uh, plaid here. And so is this uh, pillowcase. I think this is for a throw pillow just on the couch. Just your standard size throw pillow. Has a white bunny, but I thought that was adorable. Very, very cute. And it does um, just zip here. So you're just gonna unzip it, put your pillow in there, and you have your bunny ready to go. So I thought that was super cute. It's the first time I've ever gotten a pillowcase, um, a holiday pillowcase from Dollar Tree. So I, I was excited about that. All right, so now my next item are all for my granddaughter. That made it fun to go shopping here. So the first thing is Easter eggs, and they are the little bunnies, the white bunnies. There are eight of them in here, so I can fill those with some nice candy treats for her. Then there's also pink Easter grass. There's also this felt fabric um, gingham with bow. They're the little bunnies. And I'll show you what I might do with those. And I haven't decided, but I, it, the gingham went, around, went with the other things I had, so I figured I'd find something for them. Then there is this most adorable little storage container. It's actually got two pieces here. See those two pieces? So it snaps together, almost like a huge Easter egg, but it's in the shape of a bunny. It's actually called an egg container. So you can put Easter eggs in here. I'm probably gonna fill it with some candy maybe. But I'm going to do that for my granddaughter. And a bucket here that says, shake your bunny tail. And it is pink. So I got this, shake your bunny tail basket for her. I am going to put the pink grass down in it. I'm going to fill her bunny container with candy and I'm going to put it in here and then I'm going to fill her eggs with candy. I'm probably going to get some more eggs. Put those in there and then I was thinking about decorating, maybe hot gluing some of these pink gigums uh, bunnies around on the, the bucket here just to give it a little extra something, you know, maybe just maybe just two on each side, something like that. But that's what I thought I would do with those. So I got my supplies to make my granddaughter a little Easter bucket basket here. So I thought that was really cute, all with the pink. So for the basket, I got one, two, three, four, five items. Then we have the pink and uh, white gingham gnome, along with the pink and white bunny pillowcase. That is six, seven got the Easter uh, shelf sitter, eight, nine, ten, the two signs. So I thought I did a pretty good haul. I was pretty, pretty excited about, about that. So do make sure that you go down in the comments and let me know what you rate, rated my haul. One, not being so what good, ten being really good. Let me, let me know. All right, so now on to the giveaway. Uh, my giveaway rules will be down in my description box. They are the same as they always are. You must be 18 years or older. You, my giveaways are international. If you have an international address, um, I will either mail you something in a smaller sized envelope. I can fit several things in there um, that would be cost effective or it may be a gift card. And then if you have a United States mailing address, I will send you a box of goodies, um, mystery items. So you'll be getting that. 
Also, the Dollar Tree nor YouTube is affiliated with this giveaway. This is just me. It is very important that you are publicly subscribed to all 13 channels that are in this collab. Not only do you need to be publicly subscribed, but you have to comment on all 13 videos. That is how we determine if you're publicly subscribed or not because we can click on the comment and see that you are a public subscriber to that channel if you commented on that video. So do make sure that you're publicly subscribed to all 13 channels and that you commented on all 13 videos. Very important. And also give all 13 videos a thumbs up. That always helps. This giveaway will end on March the 17th. On the evening of March the 17th, I will use a random comment picker. I will pick a winner. I will make sure that you have used the secret word. I will make sure that you are publicly subscribed and have commented on all 13 videos. Once that is done, I will post who the winner is on my community tab. I will also come back to this video and I will pin a comment of who the winner is and I will reply to the winner's comment. That way, if I reply to the winner's comment, you should be getting a notification that I replied to you, so make sure your notification bell is on. Also, very important, in order to be entered in my, in order to be eligible for my giveaway, you have to use the secret word, and the secret word is pink, because that's pretty much the theme of my um, haul here was pink. So use the secret word pink in a sentence down in the comments. Once again, Huge thank you to Miss Jackie for inviting me again. I look forward to the next one. I can't wait. And huge thank you to Tracy for all her hard work and um, her multimedia skills. And I'll be talking to you all again real soon. Bye.